Well, hello everyone and welcome to Decorating with Barbara. In today's video, we're going shopping. My son is moving into a new apartment and we're gonna stop and pick up a few items for his apartment. And of course, if I see something for myself, I'll pick it up as well. And then I'll head back to my house, share with you what we picked up. And if there's time at the end of this video, I'd like to share a couple of inspirational picks. So let's go ahead and get started. So as soon as I go into Goodwill, I like to go directly to the furniture. For my son, he's looking for a sofa, a dining table, um, a coffee table and a lamp and any other accessories that we think might fit into his place but he is a no nonsense type of guy so he doesn't want a lot of frills um he's not gonna have a lot of things in his place so the few items that we pick up will be very minimal for him or very basic and essential So here they have uh, a few couches, but nothing that he wants for his place. He's 23 and so he told me he's not looking for anything that looked like it has been in an old lady's house. So not sure what that means, but okay. And we always will stop and look at the linens because you can get pillow covers, um, placemats and things like that so don't skip on the linens this was some fabric and I thought this would be great for pillows but not for him for me because we don't want him to look like he lives in an old lady's house of course okay so now we're on to home goods here we're gonna look for um, bath towels and maybe some kitchen and bath items. Now, we didn't see the sofa in Goodwill, so we did look here, but the sofas at Home Goods is not in his budget. He has good taste like his mom, but mm -hmm, he's on a beer budget. He likes recliners, just like his dad, I guess.
And if I didn't mention it before, his color palette is black, gray, and brown, and maybe some other neutrals thrown in there, but he wants a more masculine look to his place, and I get it. Now he's looking for a um, toilet paper holder. And so this particular one, and a lot of them that I've seen, they have the actual toilet paper um, holder plus the toilet paper storage. Now this one was just for storage and that's what he actually needed. And of course, it's on clearance, so mom approves. And when they're spending their own money, they will look for clearance items. But actually, I was treating today. Please step away from the candy. All right, guys, so we are back from our shopping trip and boy, did we have a time. <laughs> we picked up a few items from Home Goods. I have to say, some of my favorite pieces came from Home Goods. So, I'm not gonna get into all the little details of all the pieces. I just wanted you to see some of the items that I picked up for my son and his new apartment. Then, of course, I had to pick up a few items for myself. So, let's start with the things that I picked up for my son. Now in Goodwill, we were looking for a sofa, a dinette table, and then a coffee table. Now I didn't find the couch nor the dinette table, but I did find this beautiful coffee table. It has these nice black metal legs and it has a nice wood tone in gray and kind of a brown taupey shade. Now the table does lift up and forward so he can use this to eat at until he finds a proper dining table. And then there is additional storage on the other side of the table. So I thought that was the perfect table for a young man. And so there are a few pieces that we picked up for the living room area. I found this ceramic bowl and I thought that was a good deal. This bowl and the balls were part of the 50% um, off sale with the yellow tag. I also picked up these coasters. These came from Home Goods and they were $7.99 and these pillow covers. They were yellow tag as well, and they came from Goodwill. I'm trying to find the tag. It was down here the other day. I don't know. They were $4.49. I wanted to show you the tag because I also got 50% off of these. They were 50% off of $4.99, and the best part about these pillow covers is that they have the um, leather center. So I thought those were nice pillows for a young man. 
And then we also found this vase from Home Goods. And it's and it was $7.99. And so those were a few of the like home decor pieces. And then we just got a few essentials up here for him, some towels, some bathroom items, and things like that. And he also got this nice floor lamp for his plate. And then I found this tea towel. I'm not sure if he's gonna let me put this in his apartment, but it's worth a try. And here are a few items that we picked up for the kitchen. Some utensils. Black and wood and gray is part of his color scheme, so I thought those were really nice. And then a skillet because he needs a skillet. <laughs> Guys, we may get to see a little bit of his place. He is moving in on Friday, so I may share a few clips. I don't know if I'll do a full video or not, but let me know if you're interested in small space decorating or apartment decorating. Now, the things here for me, I found a couple of wall sconces a couple of vases, the white one or cream colored one in the back, the brown, a couple of um, candle holders, well one candle holder and one candle, a candle tray which is so beautiful. That was my favorite piece. I found napkins so you know I'm, I'm going to have to do a tablescape and then I found fabric and I think I'm going to make pillows. So. That was my shopping trip. Thanks for coming along. Don't forget to like, share, comment, and subscribe. And I hope to see you guys right back here next Wednesday. Bye-bye. All right, everyone. So the taller vase is the one from Goodwill. And I paired it with an existing vase that I got from Home Goods, And I think they work together beautifully. I also placed the little candle that I got from Goodwill with the grouping and I love the natural looking color and it also works beautifully with the vignette. Now as far as the napkin, I just added a brown napkin in addition to a natural napkin with gold trim and I put one on top of the salad plate and one underneath. Alright guys, so I went ahead and added the small vase that I got from Goodwill in brown and then I added the little votive cup on the other side with the white vase and the textured bottom. And so guys, I thought it was a good idea to bring the black marble tray into my bathroom to add that touch of black that I'm craving throughout my home.